Now, congratulations to Doncaster boxer Jamie McDonnell, who has his eyes on the world stage after adding the British bantamweight title to his collection. The 25-year-old, who already held the European and Commonwealth belts, beat the British title holder Stuart Hall over 12 rounds at a sold-out Doncaster Dome on Saturday night. Hall might have shaded the early rounds, but McDonnell took control to win a unanimous points verdict. Yeah, I won, you know, that what main thing. Um... I did believe I was going to stop him, uh, but end of the day, I, got, I still got the winning award an hour 12 rounds. Another yeah, couple yeah, of defences, yeah. probably like another six months, um, to get two defences at European in and then start looking towards fighting someone in top five. Um, I would have thought we in a year, I'd have fought for a world title and hopefully won one. Every fight now, everything's on the line. Uh, if I lose, the dream's over. Um, so I've just got to be on the ball for every fight, as long as I put the training in. Uh, I can't see me getting beat, especially at European level. When I step up to the world, I want to be stepping up there when I'm confident and, and ready to take these lads. If you got a glimpse of this at the weekend, but what a fight for Doncaster's Jamie McDonnell, who added the British bantamweight title to his Commonwealth and European belts. Yeah, real rocky stuff, wasn't it? Twelve gruelling rounds saw him beat Darlington Stuart Hall on a unanimous points decision. When he came into the studio earlier with his belts and admitted it had been a tough night at the office. It was, it was a really tough night, um, and as you can see, I've got the marks to prove it. Yeah, the only person who's been on this programme has got worse eyes than I've got. But uh, let me just ask you about how tough it was. Did you have confidence that you would win that fight? Because he was very strong, particularly at the top, wasn't he? Oh, 100% confident. That's why I took the fight. I didn't have to take the fight. Uh, I was 100% confident. I know if I got caught with any daft shots, you know, he might have knocked me out. Um, so that will be where we're going into the fight about that, but we, we had our game plan. And uh, we stuck to it and, you know, we proved, uh, you know, I am the European champion. And you very much dominated the second half of the fight, didn't you? Definitely, that was the game plan. Two after six rounds, we thought it'd start fading. We thought it'd start fading a bit sooner than when it did, which were in the back 11th and 12th. Um, but what a really tough fight. So what do you do now? I mean, after this 10-week intensive training camp that you've uh, been on, holiday? Definitely holiday. <laughs> I've got my holiday booked. Uh, I've got Doncaster races next weekend. I'll enjoy that and then... I'll have a week away with my girlfriend in Turkey. And what about the next fight? I mean, when are you lining up being, having a world title fight? World title fight, oh, I'm thinking more next summer. Um, another two European defences I'd like to think, one before Christmas, one about March time, and then some sort of eliminator or world title fight. I could say you're going to go and get plastered because you're a plasterer, aren't I am, you? Yeah. And you're going to go back to work, is that right? I'm back to modder, and I can't wait. Really? I mean, I'm after, back to after that? Yeah. Been and bought some new tools today, can't wait to <laughs> use them tomorrow. <laughs> how tough is it? I mean, you bantamweight, how, how much do you have to weigh to, to go in? Bantamweight, uh, the limit's eight stone six. Now that's nothing, I mean, that's considerably less than I weigh. How tough is it to get down to that weight? Well, it's just dedication and hard work, that's why we have a ten week camp, you know, strict diet and um, it is hard, but it's my job, that's my life now, you know, that's what I do. Just one final point, do you balloon like Ricky Hatton used to? I don't balloon, but I enjoy him, and I put a I put an extra few pounds on after the last fight. Uh, I went to Mexico for two weeks, but, you know, I, I put the hard work in, you know, so why can't I go and treat Absolutely. Myself, you know? Absolutely. Thanks Enjoy it. So well done. In. Well Thank done. You. So. It has to be said, our entire newsroom, when they heard eight stone six, he's five foot nine, he's actually taller than me, and weighs half a stone less than me. Yeah, and he puts on a stone and a half, apparently, on his holidays. Well, he deserves to, he does, deserves to. Well, on to... <laughs>